Hello guys, let's look at a game played between two grandmasters. This game shows us how important it is to take a risk. E4, E5, F4, King's Gambit. At this level, playing this opening means that he is taking a risk. It's sure that he was ready and analyzed many lines. But he was not prepared for the surprise that is yet to come. Queen H4, taking an enormous risk. For every chess player, this move is illogical. Positions that occur are not theoretical, so White has to start using his mental energy on calculating lines at this early stage of the game. G3, Queen E7, Pawn takes E5, D6, Knight C3, Pawn takes E5, Knight F3, C6, Bishop C4. It looks like White is better. He placed his pieces well and is getting ready to attack. Bishop g4, d3, knight d7, castle, knight f6, king g2. Black is defending himself well, and instead of castling queenside, he starts attacking there. b5. This move adds to an additional risk. Bishop b3, knight c5, h3, bishop takes on f3, queen f3, a5, d4, a4. A decisive moment in the game. He brought white to a com complicated position to calculate and white made a mistake. Bishop g5. Blunder that leads to a defeat. White couldn't find the move bishop f7 or bishop d5, let me show you, which um, would make some trouble for black. Bishop f7, king takes, pawn takes, queen c5, bishop e3, queen c4, queen h5, check, king h8, and queen takes e5. And the second possibility was bishop d5, pawn takes, pawn takes, queen takes, and knight d5. In both cases, white had a better position. But let's move back to bishop g5, bishop g5, pawn takes, pawn takes, a rook takes on a1, rook takes, knight e6. This is probably the move he overlooked. Pawn takes, queen b7, Bishop f6, pawn takes, pawn takes, bishop d6, knight e2, rook g8, queen f5, rook g6, g4, h6, and e5. The position is winning for black, but it's hard to imagine that the white king will stand on b4 in only a few moves. Rook g5, queen h7, c5 check, king f2, rook e5, queen d3, bishop b8, rook d1, c4, pawn takes, bishop a7, check, c5, bishop c5, king e1, queen h1, check, king d2, bishop e3, check, king c3, queen c6, check, king b4, and rook e4. As I said, king is on b4. White resigned because of the common checkmate, the final position showed that black didn't move his king for the whole game, which adds to the beauty of this game. I hope you liked this video and learned something, so see you soon!